Hello everybody, welcome to Faceless Gaming. Uh, this is a tutorial on how to connect your PlayStation 4 controller to your Xbox One using the Windows 10 streaming features. Uh, what you do is you download this program here, it's called DS4Windows.com. It's a very small and light program and it's just exactly what you need. Uh, there's no extra feet, no, it's features yes, but there's no extra BS going on inside it. Uh, what you do is you download now of course. Um, you will get this here. All you will have in this folder is a DS4 updater and DS4 Windows. If you don't know how to zip folders right now, you shouldn't be watching this. Um, you will double click DS4 Windows. Okay, let's do that. And you will get this window here. It'll have no controllers connected if your controller isn't connected. Um, if it is connected, it shouldn't show anything as of yet. Or if you have your drivers, all, everything installed, it should show up but this window will show up as well if it doesn't if anything doesn't show up just click this button here and it should show up you're on Windows 10 so you don't need step 2 it should automatically be installed uh, you can uh, connect them wired or through Bluetooth as well uh, the tutorial is all read in here so I don't need to explain that alright just hit finish and it'll get back to the screen See, mine is connected there. Make sure that it says controller one is using profile default, or it will say stop if it's the stop like, like right there. Stop the window. Make sure that it says start. Okay. Okay. Now all you have to do is open up the Xbox app, which is here. Okay. I have to have it bite my lip. <laughs> Sorry. Uh. Click this button here. It's the uh, Xbox connected, connected uh, connection to your Xbox button. Okay, now we're gonna stream. Yep, there it is. All right. One thing to note is that the share button is now your select button. So in here, you will hit. Tap it here. Beautiful thing. Right. Uh, the, P the PS button is your Xbox button, of course. Uh, let's see. Yeah. So while you're playing the Xbox, you can also control the computer as well, because the touchpad is now the mouse on your computer. But you don't have to use it as such. I mean preference everybody has a preference all right and that pretty much concludes this tutorial thank you for watching faithless is out